Jason Applebaum, and I will see you at 11.30 for lots more on Sports Drive. Joe, thanks. Thanks at 11. PG&E is blaming today's rain for widespread power outages tonight. Right now, thousands of customers are without service. The 11 o'clock news on KTV Fox 2 starts now. Hello again, everyone. I'm Julie Hayner. And I'm Greg Lee in for Frank Somerville. We are following a developing story across the Bay Area tonight. Thousands of PG&E customers do not have power right now. This is a look at PG&E's outage map. The red triangle near South San Francisco indicates more than 5,000 customers are impacted there. Another red triangle with 5,000 or more outages showing up in the Livermore area tonight. Yellow diamonds on the map are spread across the Bay Area, suggesting hundreds more outages. The good news right now is that there are fewer yellow diamonds on the map right now compared to about an hour ago. PG&E workers say this is happening due to the rain and some power transformers failing. Crews are, of course, working to correct the problem, and they say they hope to have the power restored before midnight. None of our other top stories. Schools across the Bay Area are preparing for a number of absences tomorrow. California parents and teachers who oppose school vaccine mandates plan to either walk out or not show up at all. KTDU's Zach Soft joins us now. He's live in Walnut Creek with more on this story. Zach. Good evening. Unclear right now just how many parents and their kids will take part in that uh, sit-out. The sit-out, again, taking shape after California became the first state in the country to mandate the COVID-19 vaccine for all eligible kids in order for them to attend in-person learning. I would support.